Hello, welcome to Ludic Science. Today I will make an experiment with pendulums. The experiment is the spontaneous synchronization of two penduli. And as you can see, here I have a simple pendulum. It is just a mass attached to a road and it can oscillate because it is hanging from this axis. And I have used a miniature ball bearing here in order to reduce the friction to a minimum. Therefore, once the pendulum starts to oscillate, it will take a long time until it stops. And since the experiment is the synchronization of two pendulums, I have built two identical ones. Remember that the period of oscillation of the pendulum depends only on the length of the road. Well, at least for small oscillations. And my two pendulums have identical lengths, therefore the period of oscillation is the same on both penduli. Next time you need a PCB for your electronics project, consider using the professional services of JLC PCB. JLC PCB is the world leader in PCB fabrication. You can order online. You just need to register, upload your Gerber file, and wait a few days for your PCBs at an unbeatable price. Now, in normal circumstances, the pendulums are independent of each other. If I start one pendulum and then the other, the oscillations are independent. One pendulum oscillates and the other also oscillates and they are not related to each other. However, when the pendulums are coupled, that is, they are on a base that can move, for example, I place these two cylinders and a ruler above, so this can move in this way. I put the pendulums above the ruler and everything can move from one side to the other. In these circumstances, if I start both pendulums with different movements, after some time they will start to oscillate in synchrony. They will follow the movement of the other. Well, I made the experiment and the result was uh, somewhat unexpected. I have the two pendulums mounted on the ruler and everything can move because of the cylinders below. So let me start the pendulums out of phase. And you can see how they finally synchronize, but they are not in phase. They are making an anti-phase movement, they are, their movement is 180 degrees out of phase. The movement of one pendulum is exactly the opposite of the other. So let's do it again. There it is, now they are synchronized 180 degrees out of phase. And in fact, I can start only one of them and the other starts to move until they synchronize in anti-phase movement.
I have watched several videos of other people doing the same experiment. Normally it is made using metronomes, uh, but they are, uh, they are also a type of pendulum, so we should obtain the same result. However, it is not the case. The synchronization in this case is 180 degrees out of phase and not in phase. A curious result, not sure what is causing it, but there you have it. The pendulums synchronize in anti-phase. Okay, that's all for today. I hope you liked this video. If that is the case, please visit my Patreon page. Thanks for coming to my channel and see you in the next video.